My name is Rob W. Scribner, and I'm a cinematographer and photographer based out of the Northwest region. As a photographer, one of my favorite styles of photography is long exposure. There's something about that I just constantly gravitate to. I just like the idea of that we can create something that the human eye just can't pick up. It's definitely what I like to think is part of my style, but I, I'm a cinematographer first, so I'm always thinking in motion. So I had this project I've always wanted to do. I've always wanted to film the Milky Way in time-lapse. So kind of incorporating both worlds because in order to film the Milky Way, you have to do long exposure photography. So I'm putting in place the same fundamentals of what I like to do for my personal stuff. There's a couple of things I was thinking about when deciding to do this project was what kind of camera, what kind of sensor. And to me, I felt like the FX3 and the fact that it was a full frame sensor and it was the newest line of sensitive cameras out there, paired with the 16 to 35 millimeter and the 24 to 70 millimeter G Master lenses, because of how sharp they are, it just kind of felt like the perfect combination. This project has been quite the adventure for me. A lot of my time was spent going from location to location to location. I spent a ton of time in the woods or the mountainsides alone. It was a whole lot of hurry up and wait for the sun to go down and the stars to come out. To be honest, using the cameras to capture these images that I had in my mind wasn't the hard part at all. Most of the struggles came with the environment or it came with light pollution or the fire season. So when the smoke and the fires start rolling in, there's nothing you can do but just hope and pray that you get one night that it clears up just for a moment so we can see the Milky Way in all its glory. And luckily, I was able to pull it off at least a few times. Something that really drives me is knowing that you have one shot, only one time to get something right, and that moment's gone. There's no retake. So when I'm able to capture one of those moments and get everything right, it's so fulfilling for me that it keeps me wanting to do it more and more and more. There is no doubt that this project has pushed my limits as a photographer and a cinematographer. The FX3 has allowed me to execute my vision and shoot beyond the sky. The results I've gotten have been amazing and I couldn't be happier. <laughs>